Today, I'm going to show you how to use and set up Exoterra's Incubator Pro. Now, packaging wise, Exoterra did a great job at displaying this product. But what makes their incubator stand out from the rest? Well, let's take a closer look. So check this out. Not only can you control the temperature within the incubator, you can also control the humidity as well. And this is an absolute game changer. Having this humidifier inside your incubator is going to give your clutches a much higher hatch rate. So now that we're done with the overview, let's set this bad unit up. As you can see, there wasn't much to the unboxing. You simply open up the box and take out the incubator. Now when you look at the lid, you'll see that these heating cables are strategically placed to deliver the heat evenly throughout the incubator. And this internal probe will ensure that your temperatures and humidity are on track with what you've programmed your incubator to. Now let's check out what's inside. As you can see, there's not too many loose components with this incubator. It comes with an instruction guide, some foam, and a humidifier. It's going to be easy for anybody to set this up. So the first thing we're going to do is remove the foam panel, and then we're going to add some water into the reservoir. Adding water to the reservoir is going to help maintain humidity, as well as be the source of water for the humidifier. Next, we're gonna add our humidifier. You're gonna to wanna to place it in the center, and then you can take the excess cord and run it through the groove on the side. This will keep it out of the way. Next, you're gonna to wanna to lay down your foam panel. And once this is done, your incubation level is pretty much set. Next, plug the USB end of your humidifier into the program center. And if you get it on the first try, good for you. I literally can never do that. Now it's time to program our incubator. To open up the program function, hold down the button that says set for 3 seconds. Once you do this, you'll see a green light start blinking on the right hand side next to pulse, dimming, and on off. You can use the plus and minus buttons to scroll through your options and then use set to, well, set your choice. Repeat these steps when setting your humidity, your heating, and when choosing between Fahrenheit and Celsius. And that is how you set up the Exoterra Incubator Pro. I hope this how-to video helped you out, and I hope that you get to experience the awesomeness of hatching your own reptiles. I'll catch you guys next time. Whoop!